you all know, I'm not really a fan of exercise. I love to eat and drink beer, but exercise not so much. I think I probably should exercise more to stay healthy. The problem is, it's hard to find something that keeps my interest. Finding exercise that are effective is easy. Finding something we will stick with is the hard part. After all, if we all have infinite self-discipline, we'd all be Batman. We also have a problem these days in that a lot of gyms are neither closed or just not safe to visit. So lately, I've been looking at any kind of tech coming out of Shenzhen that says it's going to make exercise at home a little more interesting. Today, I am looking at the Move It Swift Smart Boxing Gloves. They are basically boxing gloves with an app. Let's unbox them and take a look. So this is the instruction and just a pair of gloves. Okay, first I'm going to teach you how to pair the gloves with their app. You can download their app from the Google store. It's called Movie Suite. Or if you want, in their instruction, there is the QR code for you to scan to find the download link. After you install the app, click Movie Suite. Okay, we can see there is uh, some videos they have. There's the programs, core combo, leaderboard for you to compete with others, I think. So it shows the score, uh, punch count, average speed. So if you have higher score, you can rank higher in the app, right? You compete with your friends. Okay, let's go to the settings. So before you are going to use this app, you have to uh, turn on your Bluetooth and go into device. You see both of my uh, gloves are connected. So if these two are not connected, you have to connect it first before you go into the programs. All right, let's go back to uh, training. So programs. There are a couple of the simple moves, and then there's a difficult one. If you go inside, you will see instructions, and then if we hit start training, and then it is downloading, uh, on downloading the course online, it will teach you how to do boxing and stuff. Don't worry if you're a beginner, this is how you get started. Okay, and it says connecting motion modules. Motion modules are here underneath the gloves. Just the right one. Shake it to wake, to wake up. So once you shake it, it says connected. Okay. This is the right one and the left one. Take it out of the gloves. Shake the module. So now they're both connected. The video pops up. Please enter the preparation action. This gets real, okay? Uh, okay, double jab to start training. Well, I'm gonna skip it and then show you later because uh, you will see, you will see. Okay, let's start with the fundamental first. Let's start with jab.
เอาคิดบ้างโอเคอ some calories <sighs> what only six oh okay six punches give it up I think I would try something else okay um See if there is a combo. Yeah. 
Double jab. Okay, I guess I won't be giving up my day job to become a pro boxer. As you can see, the more into it I got, the more sloppy I got. And sure, if I was thinking about competing, that would be a problem and I don't need a coach to give me feedback. But just for fitness, I think it's fine. First off, the app. The app is good. I'm very surprised. Normally, these apps are really dodgy. They clearly put some time and money in. The instructor they hired is John Graham and he's actually a local Shenzhener. He's one of those energetic fitness guys and he does a really good job here. There's a good variety of videos and you really get in, into it. I think by the time you work through them all, you'll be comfortable hitting the back on your own and will be using the app less for coaching and mostly to keep count of number of hits, type and force. But the videos really do pull you in and motivate you when you start using it. It will get you off the couch, which for me is really what I'm looking for. I'd like a little more discussion of footwork. I kind of feel like I'm doing something wrong there and I don't want to develop any bad habits. The hardware. I'm told the movie Swift is going to retail for about $100. I'm pretty tuned into the local hardware manufacturing ecosystem and I can tell you that's a fair price for the hardware. The problem is that it's a really demanding application. You've got a lot of force, you've got sweat, gym bags, Something like this really needs to be IP67 certified, have induction or pogo pin charging, be submergible so you can wash it. But, and it's a big but, then it would cost two to three hundred dollars. And that's way too much money for an exercise tool that some people might not even like. So as it is now, it costs one hundred dollars and in my opinion, you can count on about a year to two years of use if you practice three to five times a week with it. Personally, I think that was the right choice on the part of the manufacturer rather than go for something super expensive. And this leaves room to create a pro model later for those that want that. Final verdict. If you are looking at amateur boxing as a sport or for MMA, I'd get some local lessons with a good coach who can give you feedback, teach you the fundamentals of distance and footwork. So when you use the movie Swift, you don't develop any habits you have to unlearn before you get in the ring. On the other hand, if you are someone like me who is just doing it for fun and prefers to exercise at home in private, and are looking for something relatively inexpensive and interesting, I think the movie Swift is a great bet. So I'll put the link in the description box for you if you are interested, okay? I think I'm going to go a few more rounds, try to burn off some of those beers from last night. Until next time, remember, if I can do it, anyone can do it.